Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. Who remembers what these are? Remember that? Let's talk about that. Stay tuned. Okay guys. Remember this? It says Panasonic on it. You guys some of you might not remember but sorry about the noise that's storming outside this is a floppy disk floppy disk now i'm showing you this this is a flea market find but not just this but it came in this camera bag we have here okay now it was in this little pocket of this camera bag. And also the camera bag has this that plugs into a camera and you can plug it directly into your monitor. And it also has this of course, your RCA jacks. Okay. But it also it's a Samsonite Samsonite camera bag but it also came with this Panasonic camera here it's got a light on it now this camera I looked at it I've got the battery charging right now I looked at this camera and inside this camera it has a memory card that you can take still images because this takes a tape in it. It does take one of these. This is Panasonic. Like I said, it has a light. It does take still images and it stores the still images on the memory card that goes inside here. Okay. Now, that is number one. Now, move this chair. Show you number two over here. As you can see, these cables and that charger and this charger right here so it's charging the battery for the Panasonic over there came in this camera bag which we have a camera bag identical to this one same same camera bag a JVC All right. we have the same camera bag only this one or ours actually broke the zipper broke here so it's still a good bag but the zipper doesn't work well this zipper works now this came with one of these things that you can put in a VCR where you put your your tape here inside there and then you stick this in the VCR and you could watch your your home movies and this came with that's original battery pack it's got a newer battery pack on the camera. I'll show that to you here in just a second. Um, which is, is charging. And this one also came with the same kind of cord as that gray one over there. You plug it in, you can plug it directly into your monitor. Um, so there's that. Again, sorry for the thunder, guys. And we have this. It's got a cap on it. The other one does have a cap, also a lens cap, but I took it off. It's sitting over there. This is a JVC camera. Yeah, they're older cameras, but they were very expensive cameras at one time. This also takes still images. As you can see, it's charging right there. It also takes um, still shot. has a bright light on it. So, and it's also got see this is where the chargers at there and it's got your jacks here so what we're going to do guys is we're going to try these cameras out okay now the batteries aren't fully charged I know that I've only been on charger for half an hour or so but we don't need to worry about that because With this camera right here, I can plug 
with this cord here get these little jacks like that what I can do is let me untangle this thing okay sorry okay what I can do is since I have the battery out of this right down in here let me turn this light on right down in here I can plug this end into that now over here maybe over here again right here you plug this into that now it'll stop this from charging but that's because it's putting the power over to the camera so let's see here let's see what we got let's open this up there it did it opened up and here is that memory card I was telling you about they have an 8 megabyte it's a Panasonic card they have it in there and there are photos on this guys I have imported them onto my PC and there's someone's wedding photos from 2005 so you know what a shame but let's see here let's turn this on just to check it here okay I don't know if you can see down in there oops and okay, so working now but let's go ahead and open this up and there we go yeah, that's a better view maybe okay so there's that one it will work guys so let's go ahead and shut this off okay it's off you don't have to use a viewfinder it will fold up that way now the JVC let's check the JVC out that's a pretty good size camera guys but man it's nice and there's that so let's kind of let's click this on for a second there it is see it in the viewfinder now Let's open this up and there we go oops let's put this down here okay. let's, let's see what it's doing right now it's saying something it's saying JVC super VHS Uh, it's telling me it's just telling me high resolution it's it's a demonstration so it's, it went into demo mode so that's pretty cool it's probably while well, create images and email they're supposed to have uh, software for it this one didn't come with software but I bet you I can get it it's got low light shot technology so that's pretty cool so I'm going to check these guys, I'm going to check this out guys, and see it just took a snapshot, but I'm going to check these out, and I may let the battery charge for a little bit, um, also it's got effects on it, uh, so does the other one, has different effects you can put on it, so what I'm going to do here guys, I'm going to just light off here. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and check these out, learn a little bit more on them. And the next clips you see will be from these two cameras. And I will tell you which ones, which, so you'll know. Like I'll say, you know, Panasonic, 
because I'll do the Panasonic first and then the next clip will be the JVC so we'll check them out and um, and you'll get to see you'll get to see how they look all right so that being said hang in there guys I'll be right back with you okay guys this is the Panasonic on something here. is going to be the JVC. Let's see which one's better. Okay guys, this is the JVC. Now this, when you know, any camera when you zoom in, it's kind of hard to hold steady so let's zoom in on that right there now watch this camera has steady shot watch this I hit steady shot look how steady that is now I'm going to take it off there it is and steady shot again pretty cool so which one let me know in the comments below which one you guys like. Alright, I'll be back with you in a minute for my closing. Stay tuned, don't go away guys. Okay, <laughs> I forgot something. I know what you guys are wondering, right? what I gave for these at the flea market well I'll tell you what I gave for them the guy saw me looking at them and he says you know I don't I'm tired of looking at these things I don't want them around no more I don't know anything about them he says I'll sell them to you for ten bucks I said ten bucks a piece he said no you want them I'll sell them to you for ten bucks I looked him over, he had some tripods, but they were all missing the top part of the tripod that you put your camera on and then it clicks in. They were nice tripods, but you're missing that piece, they're kind of useless unless you want to go and build one. So anyway, I said, I'll, I'll think about it. So we walked around and then we, a little bit, and then I come back, I told her, I said, I'm going to make him an offer on them. You know, I said, uh, the bags are worth that. I needed a new bag because my other one, the zipper broke. I said, but I think I can get them cheaper. So I walked walked back there. We went back, and I was talking to him. I said, look, dude, you take $7 for them cameras. You want 10 for both, I'll give you 7 for both of them. He was like, oh, man, I don't know, you know. How about I give you one camera of your choice and a tripod? I said, the tripod's not going to do me any good. I'm not going to mess around trying to make a piece for it. I said, there's... I'm just not going to do that. They're no good to me. I'll give you $7 for both cameras. He said, well, I don't know. I said, well, all right, buddy. You know what? That's, that's cool. I understand. Uh, thank you for your time, and have a great day. And I started to walk away. He goes, now, wait a minute. Now, wait a minute. All right, come on. Come on. You want them for 7 I'll give them to you for 7 He says, you need to be working here at my tables, you know. He says, uh, uh, you did the walk away on me. He said, I've done it a bunch of times. He said, as soon as you did that, I knew you had me, but he said, that's cool. He said, yeah, $7, no problem, because I told him, you know, the bags are worth that. I said, the cameras, I have a bunch of cameras, but he said, well, maybe you can sell them. I said, well, you know, if I got a camera, I'm not really going to sell it. I'll, I'll keep them. I've got quite a little collection of these older cameras, and every camera I have works. But uh, so anyway, so I did the walk away on him, and uh, 
He was like, oh, "All right, man." He said, "I do that all the time, and here I got, I got nailed with my own technique." So yeah, because sometimes you know you just like, "Well, thank you. Have a good day. Thank you for your time." You start walking away. They don't want money to walk away, you know. Especially if it was a fair offer. I was willing. If he'd have said eight, I would have gave him eight dollars for him. But I, I was hoping we could dick her like that. I'll say seven. He say eight. You know, okay, cool. Because he said ten. I said seven. Then he come down to seven, and I'm gonna stick at seven. So, but I would have went up to eight. But anyway, seven dollars. So okay, guys, there you have it. The first clip was from this one the Panasonic and the second clip was from the JVC this one here now on the second clip you might have noticed a little bit of flubbering up on top that was not from the camera that's that's from the tape that's in there it's not a new tape it's an old tape that came with one of our other cameras that we bought similar to that one. Actually, I'll, tell you, I'll show you which one it came with. It came with um, this JVC. You guys may remember the uh, the, um, the video I did on when I got this one. But there you have it. Now, I'll tell you what I like and dislike about them. Okay? First thing, what I dislike about this one is it doesn't have I mean, it's got a digital image stabilization, but it doesn't, it doesn't have what the JVC has. Okay, so that's what I don't like about this one. Other than that, it's, it's a fine camera. It works fine. Okay, it does have a light on it, but uh, it doesn't have low light. Okay, now this one here, I like everything about it. The steady shot, the zoom is super. Um, it does have a light that you can set on on and auto, just as well as the JVC or the uh, Panasonic. But this one, it also has low light shot. It's almost almost like a, a night. Um, it does really well, but what I do not like about this is on playback, the uh, display will not go away. There's no way to turn the display off. So when I import it, if I use this camera, it's going to have the display on the screen. I do not like that. To whereas this one is the one I use to import, and as you can see that you know on the video, there's it's just the video. There's no um, time up here there's no battery symbol although you can you know you can turn it off and on this one all you can do is minimize it and now I may be doing I may be overlooking something on it I don't know but yes I do like this one better other than that um, it does do well it has a hell of a zoom on it um, so and they both have a good zoom but I just love the steady shot with this one here you can take still images with both of them although this one like I said before has a memory card for your still images this one does not but you can still take still images and um, so there you go there's what there's what we're looking at there guys let me bring you up here to me If the light's gonna let me zoom out maybe I am zoomed out so anyway guys there's too much light in here all of a sudden so anyway guys there's my flea market finds my seven dollar flea market finds um, So let me know in the comments below what, which camera you guys think is better as far as quality. The second clip, like I said, you have to, that was up above there, that it was kind of messed up a little bit. That wasn't the camera, that's that's just an old tape. We don't know how many times it had all kinds of videos on it when we, when, when we got the camera. So I'm going to get some new tapes and, but let me know what you guys, you guys think of it, which one's the best one. 
and your book. What do you like better? I like the JVC. I like them both. They're both, to me, kind of equal. But um, what I like about the, the Panasonic is there's no display on the screen, you know, to import. Uh, I don't like that about the JVC. Now, the Panasonic does not have a real good stabilization to whereas the JVC does. Now these are old cameras guys, remember from what, 90s, late 90s, early 2000s, right in there. Um, I could probably check and find out, but they're old cameras, but that's okay, because I still use them. There's some videos that, that we have done with, with our old, old cameras like that, and it's really kind of hard to tell unless the tape messes up on you, but anyway guys, thanks for watching, have a great week. And y'all be kind to one another here. <laughs> All right, guys, remember, Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone. Bye-bye, guys.